Hi guys, Rebecca Creates here with what I received in the swap for the hashtag Christmas Shadow no, Christmas Shaker Shadow Box Collab 2021, which was hosted by Karamia's Corner here on YouTube. And this package came yesterday, but I didn't want to open it until the actual collab videos came out. Um, so now that they're all uploaded. And hopefully you've seen them. I'll link the um, the hashtag down below so that you can go over to that playlist and see the shadow box that all six of us um, created. My swap partner was Clarissa, who is um, Karamia's Corner here on YouTube. She was the host of this collab. And she randomly assigned people in the collab to swap the shadow boxes they created with each other. So I took this out of the package and I unwrapped some of the cute things that she put in as little extras. Thank you so much, Clarissa. Um, the first thing was this adorable little uh, mailbox ornament, which is definitely going on my tree. So cute. This little gnome. <laughs> I love these gnomes. And she's been on a gnome kick. Um, her last haul, she said that was it. No more gnomes. So this one's really cute. It's a nice green color, which is, is perfect because um, my Christmas decor is mostly traditional red and green. And I do have like some white and, and golds mixed in. And then how fun is this? She took a small mason jar and she filled it with tons of little beads that you can use like for dangles, which I love to do. And it's so funny because she did a recent Hobby Lobby haul and she showed these tiny little, um, hopefully it's showing and there's not too much glare, these tiny little beads that look like, um, they're actually mini ornaments, right? They look like little Christmas light bulbs. And I saw them in her haul and I went on the Hobby Lobby website and I actually um, put them in my cart because they're on sale now because I guess of Black Friday week. But you have to spend 50 to get free shipping and I didn't have $50 worth of things. So they're just sitting in my cart. But she gifted me quite a few. There's so many in there. So thank you for that. That was so sweet. Um, she didn't even know that I was looking for them or that I really wanted them. So just fun. There's flat backs in there. Little star beads. I can't wait to get into this and open it. Okay, but let's get on to the fun part. So this was how it's packaged and really clever. She wrapped her shadow box in a scarf. I'm so worried my shadow box didn't get there um, safely, but we'll, we'll find out soon enough. Um, let me just cut the tape there. And she sent me a cute little Christmas card. How sweet. Warm wishes and it has a little gingerbread cookies and coffee oh thank you Clarissa and I hope that you and your family have an awesome Christmas as well so let me just do some cutting of the tape here okay she really packaged this so well oh my goodness i didn't package mine like this this is so sweet oh my gosh she put in this really pretty scarf and it's tied in a ribbon oh you guys this is so sweet okay beautiful scarf that i would definitely be using i love scarves you guys have a ton of scarves i'm like a scarf person uh, okay Oh, I didn't know. Okay, so the shadow box was, I should have, I should have opened this sooner. Sorry, you guys, just bear with me. I'm just cutting through the tape. I'm excited to see it. I'm excited to see it in person. Okay, let me get rid of all of this. This was that fun bubble wrap that she used when she sent us the shadow box. This was really cool. And, it, and some washi that says joy and love. All right, you guys, she put the cardboard to protect the front of it. Okay, I'm just gonna rip through it. Oh, how pretty. This is so beautiful. Okay. She did a good job with the back, you guys. Oh. Hi, I light up C switch on left. Oh my goodness. Look, you guys. Hold on. Let me get it right. Let me get it right. 
this one little dangle doesn't want to come down but how adorable oh my god you guys i'm sorry for the glare but i don't know can you see this that image <gasps> <sighs> so pretty and she said be creative with your shaker bits and i don't know if you can see but there's like a little pillow and a little um it looks like a candy down there there's the flat back gems the big ones there's snowflakes there's big glitter and then she used beautiful glitter paper then she put some trim at the top at the seam of that image and then hold on she did such a good job covering up the lights look how cute you guys i love it i love it this beautiful bling trim and um it's just sealed up so nicely on the back oh my gosh i the back of mine looks so rough i haven't seen if she did an unboxing of mine yet but clarissa don't <laughs> don't flip the shadow box over look how pretty you guys so pretty she covered the back in paper why didn't i think of that when i did mine the the light box you know it was like popped up she has a light box that's really thin so it worked out where she could just put some layers of foam tape and it covered it some glitter did come out look but that's okay there's still tons of glitter in it just barely it really survived wow and she put these fun huge flat backs in it i love it and those little um beads that i said i love it's so pretty this came down a little it needed to be up there but that's okay it did surprisingly well i'm so worried how does mine look after shipping i wonder how it got there anyway okay i'm rambling i'm so sorry you guys but this is so pretty isn't it so pretty i'm putting the hashtag in the description box below or maybe it'll be in the title you can click on that and get to the playlist where you'll see the six ladies that were part of the collab and you can see cara mia's video on how she created this and she shows it off just really pretty clarissa thank you for inviting me to be a part of this collab i really had fun with it i hope we do it again next year um yeah so let me know what you guys think of clarissa's go over and show her some crafty support as well as the other ladies and as always thanks for watching guys bye